Let's sing this out together and worship our God. Come on. that God is far from done in our lives and in this life together, God is still working. And I wanted to just take this moment and just breathe and take, uh, take this time to just spend a little bit in God's word. And if you have your Bibles, you can turn to Ecclesiastes chapter 3. And uh, I, I've been loving this verse and I've been reading it in, in Ecclesiastes this past uh, couple weeks here. And I love what... Uh, this passage is saying, and it's talking about seasons of life, and we all go through seasons of life. It's, we're in one right now, and one of the things that I love that it says is it talks about how there's a time to be born and a time to die, a time to plant, a time to uproot, a time to kill, and a time to heal, a time to tear down, and a time to build, and he's talking about all of this, and as I'm reading this, I couldn't help but to just think about my family, my friends, my, my coworkers, the people that are I'm interacting with on the daily. I think a lot of times when we're reading the passages and, and God's word and we go to church and we hear about seasons of life and going through difficulties, a lot of times we're internalizing everything for ourselves, but then we also forget that we're all struggling with something. We're all going through our own problems, our own uh, storms, and we're all going through our own seasons. And if you wanna follow along with me, uh, we could just read this out loud together. And it says in Ecclesiastes chapter 3, There is a time for everything, and a season for every activity under heaven. A time to be born, and a time to die. A time to plant, and a time to uproot. A time to kill, and a time to heal. A time to tear down, and a time to build. A time to weep, and a time to laugh. A time to mourn, and a time to dance. A time to scatter stones, and a time to gather them. A time to embrace, and a time to refrain. And he goes on and goes on and goes on to all these different seasons of that we all face on a daily basis sometimes. Every single person is struggling with something in their life, and we're all going through seasons. Some good, and if we're honest, some are just awful. 
But as I said before, we're all going through seasons of life, and I wanted to take this opportunity, and maybe as we're singing this next song, to really do some soul searching in how have I been with interacting with those closest to me? How have I reacted with all the pressure and in my season of life, how am I lifting other people up? You know, Pastor Rick talked about standing strong this past weekend in a very weak world. And we know that this world that we live in is very weak. How are we lifting each other up? As I said, as we sing this next song, let's, let's dive into ways that we can reach out to a friend that we haven't talked to. How we can communicate better with our spouse that we live with every single day. And in the end, how can we wake up every single day knowing that this breath that he's given us, that this life that we live is not ours, but it's his. How, how do we go about our lives and lifting each other up every single day? And most importantly, how do we give God the glory in every moment that we live? Let's sing this next song and let's just pray and ask God for that wisdom to lift each other up and to support each other in this season.
Yes, Jesus, we praise your name this afternoon. And Lord, we just ask for your wisdom. We ask for you to speak so clearly into our, our lives, how we can support and how we can lift each other up in this season. We know that this season is very hard. And we know that it's hard on each other. And it's hard on every person around us. So Lord, teach us and show us how we can truly love one another. Father, we worship you and we praise you. We love you. In Jesus' name. Hey, thank you all so much for tuning in online. We love you guys so much, and we'll see you next week. God bless.